two kids. I've got a four-year-old daughter, her name is Neela, and a seven-year-old son, his name is Brayden. And today I'm going to be showing everything that I got them for Easter, and I'm just going to jump right into the video. Okay, so we are going to start with my daughter, um, and you will see that as I go through, my kids really got very similar things. I tried to coordinate for the most part, and I tried to make sure it was as even as possible. Um, I feel like Mila probably got like one or two more things than Brayden, but I really don't think that they'll notice. So I'm going to jump into things that I got from Mila. So the first thing that I got her is this bathing suit. Looks like this. This bathing suit came from Target and it was $15. I think it's so cute. Um, I really like to add things for like the spring and the summer for the kids. I like to go ahead and get them a jump start on things like that. The next like clothing like item I guess you could say I got her is an Easter dress. It looks like this. Um, also from Target as you can see I went to Target for a lot of this stuff. This dress was $15. It just has a little Easter bunny on it and we're actually going to be out of town um, Easter weekend but I thought it would be so cute to just put her little Easter dress in her basket. Um, that way the kids will kind of know what they're supposed to wear on Easter and hopefully they won't fight me over it because the Easter bunny is bringing it so hopefully that'll like bribe them to wear it because my kids like to pick out their own clothes. And then the last like clothing item I got Mila for her Easter basket is pajamas. They look like this. So, and then it comes with two actually. And these were also from Target and they were $15.99. So yeah, thought that was a good deal for a two set. And I really like how it comes with the shorts since it's getting warmer outside. Um, okay, so now I'm going to jump into like, I guess like the toys that I got. I really try not to be crazy with toys because it is Easter. It's not any crazy holiday, but I did go ahead and pick up this for her. Um, so this actually came from Dollar General. It was only $5 and my kids really, they have always loved doing these, um, so yeah, I wanted to pick her up this and it comes with two of them. I thought that was super cute. I think that she'll absolutely love this. And since we're going to be going out of town, maybe that'll like keep her entertained on the drive back. And then I also got from Dollar Tree. I'm sorry, this video is everywhere. Um, the stores are just everywhere. It's not in any type of order, but I will make sure that I include where I went for everything. I got this little toy. It's from Dollar Tree, and you just put the balls in the bunny's mouth, and it can spit them out. I thought that was really cute. And then I also got from Walmart, I got them Frisbees. Hers looks like this. I thought that was really cute. And again, I'm just trying to do, like, a lot of outdoorsy things for them. Um, and they've never used Frisbees before, so how fun will that be? I also got her a book. This is from the Target dollar spot. It was only a dollar. It's just like a little Disney princess book. I also got her some of this. What is this? It's like some sort of foam and it came from Dollar Tree. I just thought that was really cute. I got Brayden like slime for Valentine's Day and she was really upset that she didn't get any. So I made sure I got both of them one of those. And then let's see. I also got this right here. I got this from the Target dollar spot. It was $3. And I just thought this was so cute. Mila has had something like this before where you can kind of, um, it's a magnet and you can choose Elsa's outfit. And like I said, she's had one of these before and she loved it. And Mila likes doing things like this. So I really think that she will enjoy that. Um, I also got from Dollar Tree pretty sure that's where this came from, a jump rope. I thought that would be so fun to teach the kids how to jump rope. I don't know if Mila will quite get it. I don't know. Maybe she'll surprise me, but Dollar Tree. <clears throat> and then again, the Target Dollar Spot, I got each of them light up yo-yos because a little while ago, Brayden said that he wanted a yo-yo that lights up 
and then I found it at the Tyler Do the Target dollar spot for a dollar so I went ahead and picked that up and I also got because you know they just have to have bubbles for Easter they have to have bubbles so I got them bubble guns I just thought this would be more fun for them how much was this even I honestly don't know how much it was it was in like the summer stuff if I had to guess I would say it was probably like five dollars but yeah my kids they've had one of these before and they absolutely love them I feel like they don't last very long I don't know maybe that's just me but anyway I thought those super cute a fun way to do bubbles and then also I didn't realize that I got them the bubble gun when I went out and bought these bubbles from Dollar Tree it's a two-pack so I thought that was a pretty good deal to get a two-pack from Dollar Tree but you can never have enough bubbles um let's see and then also from Dollar Tree I thought this was so cute for Mila um, it is these little fingernail polishes. They look like this. And they have little bunnies on them. So I thought it was perfect for her Easter basket. And she loves fingernail polish. And then I also got her a water bottle. Looks like this. Has all kinds of cute little things on it. I actually think these are stickers. And they're supposed to decorate the water bottle. So that'll be really cool. And it has like a little straw on it. So I really like that and then I don't know if this is like too excessive for Easter but it was only ten dollars um I had gotten which you'll see in a minute I got Brayden a toy and I felt even though I guess I got Mila some toys too I felt like it was unfair um so I wanted to pick her out a little toy and I got her this um so this was only $10. It's a little Polly Pocket. And when I was younger, I absolutely loved Polly Pockets. And there's another girl that I watch on YouTube who got her daughter, who's the same age as Mila, a Polly Pocket for Christmas. And her daughter's obsessed with it. So I was like, maybe Mila will be obsessed. I don't know. Maybe she'll like it. Um, I don't have to watch her with like little pieces like this. It'll be totally fine. Mila knows not to put things in her mouth now but this is so cute like here's the back of it it came from tj maxx so it has like a little jacuzzi asana and it comes with a little car for the little poly pockets to go in and she loves the barbie so i just know that she'll love this i think that'll entertain her especially if she needs something on the ride back because we're gonna do easter while we're on our trip so yeah and then as far as stuffed animals go i am so like iffy on stuffed animals because my kids don't really play with them we always end up just getting rid of them but i found these little bunnies look how cute they are i thought these were so cute like i had to buy them look how fluffy these little ears are oh my gosh and only 5.98 and i thought that was such a good deal for how cute this little bunny was and brayden and mila got like you'll see they got very similar things like he got the same exact bunny just a different color and then I so this year instead of doing Easter baskets I wanted to get creative because I bought my kids really nice baskets last year and I really want to reuse them so instead of getting new baskets I decided to get umbrellas so um so yeah, their Easter baskets will actually be Easter umbrellas, but I'm still going to bring their baskets from last year because we're going to figure out a way to do a little Easter egg hunt while we're there. So I still want them to have baskets so they can do a little Easter egg hunt with. But I'm going to, I know it's bad luck, but I'm going to show you what this umbrella looks like. And I did pick this up at Target and it was only $5. So I'm going to go ahead and... This is what it looks like. I don't know how well you can see this, but look how cute. Look at the little um, butterfly wings. Like, oh my gosh, that is so cute. I love it. And it was actually raining today and I was just sitting there thinking like how nice it would have been to have these umbrellas. But yeah, hold on. You cannot come in here. Mila she wants me for whatever reason I'm trying to be like quiet too because I don't want them to hear me talking because my kids are sneaky 
But yeah, I'm going to stuff everything in this umbrella and I actually did like a test run on it and everything like barely fits in here. So I don't know how that's going to work. I'm not going to set anything up during this video. So if you are interested to see what it looks like, I will be doing a video um, on Easter. I just don't feel like opening the grass because it's another thing I got is grass, of course. Honestly, I don't know why I got grass. It was only 98 cent from Walmart. Um, I don't even know why I got it because I don't even think you'll be able to see the grass with everything else that's going to be on top of it. I may go ahead and set it up and just see what it looks like. I don't know. I'm being indecisive. I guess we'll see at the end of this video if I decide to set up their umbrellas just to see what it's going to look like because I am really excited. So moving on to the candy items, I really didn't get that much candy because they're going to get so much candy in their eggs. And we still have candy from Easter and, or not Easter, but Christmas and Valentine's Day. So the first little candy item I got is this little bunny. Um, it's just a little Pez. My kids absolutely love these. So I know they'll be excited to get that. I also got this little carrot, this little Reese's carrot. I thought the kids would like that too. And then um, both of those candies came from Walmart. And honestly, I don't know how much the Pez was. I want to say the carrot was probably a dollar, but from Dollar Tree, I got this little candy tube egg. Um, I think it's just like M&M's. Obviously, it's like off brand, but I think they just taste like M&M's. And then my kids love Peeps. <clears throat> I absolutely hate Peeps. I think they're disgusting, but my kids love them. So, went ahead and added those. And um, I don't know where those peeps came from either. I think Dollar Tree had them. They probably came from Dollar Tree. Um, I also got them these from Dollar Tree, these little sour bunnies. Not quite sure how Mila's going to feel about them, but Brayden loves sour stuff. So I don't know. She likes to be like her brother, so maybe she'll like it too. And then the last thing I got for Mila's basket is this little LOL surprise egg. I think it literally just has jelly beans and stickers yep that's what it says jelly beans and stickers and I can't remember how much this was but I know I got it at Target so that is everything I got for Mila for Easter I'm mad at myself because I did not get either kid chalk how do you forget to get chalk I'm really upset about that but anyway I'm gonna move into Brayden's stuff so I'm gonna start with his Easter outfit that we picked out for him it looks like this I wanted him to have um, pink because Mila's wearing pink and I don't know I think that pink is so cute for Easter even though his shirt has alligators on it it's okay um, his shirt came from Target it was nine dollars and then to match his shirt we got him some shorts still like this and they were $12.99 I thought these shorts were so cute and he can wear them with other stuff too of course and then for his bathing suit we just got him some spider-man swim trunks he loves spider-man i wanted to get him like a cuter pair and like in my opinion for easter but i know that this is what he likes so i just went with what he likes and these were 14.99 and then for Brayden's pajamas, I got him this Spider-Man set. Um, my kids love pajamas and Brayden is obsessed with the Miles Morales Spider-Man. So I made sure I got those pajamas. I look like this. And the day that I was at Target, they didn't have two packs of pajamas for Brayden. So I just had to um, get what they had. And his pajamas were $16. So then getting started into like, I guess his toy items. He also got a jump rope like Mila, his is blue. And then he also got this foam like Mila, the same exact one. He also got this little bunny toy, again, same exact toy as Mila. He also got a frisbee and it has dinosaurs on it. Again, it's from Walmart, same stores. And then he also got a bubble gun except for his is green and hers is blue and I went back and forth on who what color I wanted to give what kid because I really wanted to give Brayden the blue one but the only reason I gave it to her is because the background of it was pink and it matched her stuff so yeah <clears throat> and then 
I got Brayden something that I didn't get Mila. Um, it is this egg and it's a Lego and it makes this little car and I actually got this from Hobby Lobby. So yeah, I thought that was really cute. And I cannot remember how much it was. So it says it was $2.99, but everything was on sale. I think it was like 40% off. So, and then he got Bubbles too, like Mila. And he also, I was a little iffy on this, but he got this, um, like Mila did from the dollar spot at Target. It was $3. So she got the Elsa one and I got him Iron Man because I thought maybe he would enjoy it. I don't know. We'll see. I'm a little nervous about it because he is seven and he acts like he's like a teenager. So I don't know. We'll see. He also got a water bottle, the same one as Mila. So it's got the little stickers in it so he can decorate it himself and his is dinosaur. And then he got an Avengers yo-yo that lights up like Mila. And then for his toy since I got her the Polly Pocket. So yeah, he got this pop figure from Hobby Lobby and it is just Baby Yoda. He loves Baby Yoda. And is this one? This is a bobblehead one. He really likes the bobblehead ones. My son is obsessed with pop figures and I know that they're supposed to be used to collect, but he does not collect them. He takes them out the box and he plays with them. I really don't care. It's not a big deal to me, but yeah, he loves them. And I saw this one. My child is obsessed with baby Yoda. So I went ahead and picked that up for him. And then for his teddy bear, I got him this gray one same exact one as Mila and he actually told me the other day that he wanted um a toy bun or a stuffed bunny for about um Easter I keep getting all these holidays confused but yeah I just thought these were so cute again it was only six dollars and then for his umbrella it looks like this it's like a camouflage looking one and his umbrella was ten dollars how much was hers I don't even see a price tag on hers. I don't think there is one. I can't remember. I feel like hers was $10 too. Um, and I was so mad because I went to Marshall's right after Target. And Marshall's has umbrellas for like $5. And they had more options to choose from. Like for Brayden and Mila at Target, they literally just had like one. And I think this will be perfect. I'll show you Brayden's too. This is what... His looks like so nothing special it's just camouflage but yeah I think that they will both really enjoy these and then he also got grass 98 cent from Walmart and then I will show you the candy items I got for him so I found this little bat it's like filled with gumballs so yeah I thought that was really cute I got that bat from Target and I cannot remember how much it was but Brayden just recently started playing baseball for the first time and he absolutely loves it like I'm kind of surprised how much he likes it because he was a little iffy on playing at first but since he likes it so much I saw that bat and I had to get it and then I also got him this little ball and this came from Target and it is gum too. So he's going to have lots of gum. And then he also got a bunny, a little Pez. He also got Peeps. And these are blue. And then he got the um, Sour Bunnies as well from Dollar Tree. And these little Reese's Carrot. And then these M&Ms with the little egg on it. And the last thing he got was the surprise egg that Mila got. And his also got hair on it. I have so much hair. Um, he got Baby Yoda because, again, he loves Baby Yoda. And it just has jelly beans and stickers in it. So, um, I feel like I got them a little more than what I meant to. But I bought everything over, like, a period of a few months. It's not like I just went and picked all this stuff out. Um, when I go to the store, I just kind of see what they have. But anyways, I hope that everything is split up pretty evenly. I was a little nervous about that. But I think that, in my opinion, it's split up evenly enough. But yeah, 
I'm super excited. I know the kids are going to love everything they got and I would say I hope this gives you ideas on what to put in your child's Easter basket but it's going to be a little too late for that because this video probably won't go up till Easter weekend. But anyways, I really appreciate anyone who...